New details about the death of a Whiteland High School student who apparently drowned in PE class while swimming laps. WRTV's Nico Panisi is live outside of Whiteland High School. And Nico, how is the community and the school district remembering the girl tonight? Mark, Nicole, there is a growing memorial outside of Whiteland Community High School right now. Flowers, photographs, Elena, we will miss you, written in chalk on the sidewalk. The entire Clark Pleasant Community School Corporation is heartbroken at the loss of this 15-year-old girl, who family and friends describe as sweet with a heart of gold. Superintendent Dr. Patrick Spray held a press conference this afternoon to give remarks on the student's death. He has this to share about the type of person she was. This young lady was such a beautiful human who loved her family, her friends, her community, art, animals, and band. The Johnson County Sheriff's Department is still gathering facts and information regarding the drowning. Here's what we know so far. The student was in the pool during physical education class, swimming laps with the rest of the students. A lifeguard and instructor were present on the pool deck at the time. She went under the water near the bulkhead that divides the pool. When she was removed from the water, despite school and staff and emergency responders' efforts, she died. The coroner says the official cause of death will take three weeks before it is released. And family and friends have released a GoFundMe page. They've established a GoFundMe page for funeral and memorial expenses, and that's according to the website. They have a goal of $10,000, and we just checked. At last check, they've raised 8500 This is a developing story. We'll continue to update you on air and on web with the latest. Reporting live in Whiteland, Nico Panisi, WRTV.